Welcome, I'm Jessica. Thank you for checking out my channel. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you my Target Dollar Spot or uh, Bullseye Playground, whichever one you call it, Halloween Haul 2019. All right, before we get started, this channel is all about crafts, DIYs, a lot of farmhouse because I like to decorate in the farmhouse style. Um, also different holidays. I love decorating for holidays. In this particular video, it's a Halloween haul. Yes. And uh, decorating and also homemades and DIYs for your furry family because I'm also a pet parent coach and dog trainer. So get into our Target dollar spot or I don't know which one do you guys call it let me know in the comments do you call it the Target dollar spot or the bullseye playground I've heard it called both I think it's technically the bullseye playground but hey it's I mean which one do you call it let me know post in the comments and let me know if you uh, like this anything in this video at any point in time please give it a thumbs up not only does it help my channel but it also helps YouTube figure out what kind of videos you like so it can suggest things suggest other videos for you to watch that are similar to this one um, so let's get right on into oh if you like this type of video go ahead and hit that subscribe button I would really appreciate it help my channel grow and once you hit that subscribe button smash that bell that way you get notified every time I post a new video so let's get right into this um I'm gonna say it's a fall slash Halloween Target haul and I think everything I got was from the um bullseye playground now these are probably going to be like the prized pieces from this haul and i know that uh bargain bethany found three different ones i was honestly a little bit disappointed because the one that i wanted i couldn't find i went to two different targets and um I found both of these. I found these two. The one I did not find was the one I really wanted, which was the one that had like the, the black metal pole kind of like this um, with two circular wooden trays. That was the one I really wanted, but I did find these two. So I'm super happy about that. They were each $5, which is a super good deal. Um, you just get these two tiered trays and you can kind of see how big they are. They're not huge, but for $5, they're they're pretty nice um so i'm definitely gonna decorate these in another video for you guys but i'm super excited about these tiered trays and then i got my goodie bag over here i think the next thing that i'm most excited about is this sign <laughs> you guys i think that this cat is like the cutest i absolutely love decorating with dogs and cats because i'm i'm an animal person and so halloween plays really well into that because of the black cats um so this is a su substantial sized sign and i'm trying not to get the ring light on it so you can actually see it but it says black cat tavern potions elixirs brews open from dusk till dawn and it has a really nice size black cat on it it's um like a faux wood because i think this is actually particle board or mdf whatever you want to call it and then it has the uh, two layered black um uh outline around the sign i don't know what I, I the term is leaving my head but I think this is my second favorite I'm definitely gonna do some DIYs and kind of distress this we'll do that in another video this was also five dollars I'm just I'm, I'm super stoked about this one because I know I told you in another video this is really my first year decorating for Halloween and I love black cats and Halloween and scary movies 
And my very favorite movie is Hocus Pocus. Hey, let's make that the question of the video. Post in the comments below, what is your favorite Halloween movie? First of all, my favorite movie of all time, I think is um, Practical Magic. I love Hocus Pocus, but I'm gonna say Practical Magic. Magic. So that would not only be like my favorite movie of all time, but probably my favorite Halloween movie, unless we get into scary movies and then like there's a whole new world opening up. So post in the comments below, what's your favorite Halloween movie? I would love to know that. And I'm super stoked about this find. They had a few different signs, the same size. In fact, one of them was a Ouija board and I almost grabbed it too, but I just didn't have a ton of room to decorate for Halloween because I'm doing mostly fall with a small Halloween section inside of my house. And then the outside of my house, I'm gonna do do it up for Halloween. So I just didn't have a ton of room that I'm designating for Halloween this year inside of my house. So I didn't want to buy both of them. The Ouija board was super cute. Also $5, the same size. So go grab it if, if you can, if they still have some in stock because that Ouija board, whew, that was on the money for Halloween. Okay, so my dog wanted to go outside. So I might actually have a little bit of noise I apologize if I do, and I will try to get rid of it. Um, so let's continue in my little goodie bag. Oh, let me show you this. My mom actually sent me this bag. It's just one of those 99 cent bags from Marshalls. But look at all those sugar skulls. It's so cute. And I filled this at Target. Actually, two Targets I went to, but I still, I filled it. Um, and I didn't spend a ton of money filling it because I shopped at the Bullseye Playground or the Target Dollar Spot. Again, in the comments, let me know which one you call it. Okay, so my next find at Target in the Dollar Spot or the Bullseye Playground was this super cute metal basket. Um, it's called a wire web basket and it was $3. And I just really liked it. Now, I will say Dollar Tree has one very similar to this, except it has like little spiders in the webbing. Um, I don't know off the top of my head, but I'm gonna say probably four of them, but it's plastic. And in, the only ones I've seen were a like bright orange and a bright purple. So you would definitely have to spray paint them with like a matte black spray paint to get them to look like this. So for just $2 more, I don't have to spray paint it and it's metal, so it's a higher quality. So it will probably last longer um, than the plastic one from Dollar Tree. So I just really liked this and I may or may not change it up. I'm not sure. Let me know, what would you do? Would you change it up? I actually saw somebody last year who did do a DIY with the plastic one from Dollar Tree super cute. I'm not going to let you know what she did because I might try to do something similar, not the same, but similar. Thank you. Kim's barking. I need to go check on her. Okay. So I went and checked on Kim. Now let's finish our Target dollar spot fall slash Halloween 2019 haul because I got some goodies. Okay. Um, the next Thing. I actually got a bunch of these. So let me show you all of these different fabric pumpkins were just a dollar a piece. So let me pull them all out of the bag. I, um, for fall, I did very neutral beiges, burlap, and I added a tiny bit of green. Um, not like a hunter green, but like a lighter green. And I absolutely loved Loved, loved the way it turned out. I'm not done with it. I have one more piece that I need to find to complete my mantle and then I'm gonna show you guys. But in the meantime, let's see. Yes, okay, I grabbed them all. So let me show you the two different ones first. This one is a foam pumpkin. And it actually looks pretty similar to a DIY one I did from 
a Dollar Tree, but this one was just a dollar at the Target dollar spot and I don't have to DIY it, it's already done. So the one I actually DIY'd from Dollar Tree is right behind me. So it's very similar. So you can see I did like this linen color and then I kind of speckled it with a brown spray paint on top of the chalk paint. So this one's a little, like the speckles are a lot darker and um, appear a little bit better and it's a little whiter, but I don't have to DIY it and it was only a dollar too. So, I mean, super cute. And then the other one that's different is this sequined pumpkin. So this one is going to be super cute with my Halloween decor inside of my house. Also just a dollar at Target. Um, and then I really like with these the ones at Target, even though they're just a dollar, like you would get at the Dollar Tree, um, the stems don't look so super fakey that you want to redo them. So I don't have to DIY these. I can just use these for decor. So this one is, uh, like, yeah, that kind of, oh, so cute. So I'm going to use this with my Halloween decor. And then I got two black ones which are just the black cloth. They're really soft too. And then, let's see, I got two different plaid ones which are gonna kinda go with the, um, the black. Then I got two in this cute green-ish, blue-ish color, which I have blue glass and then green um, in my fall decor. So these are gonna go really well in my fall decor. Then I got two that are these like tan slash beige color and one in this like burnt orange color. So all of these were just a dollar a piece at Target, super cute. And then I got this pack of these tiny little ones um, for $3 that match this. So they're foam ones, but they're smaller. Um, they match my dollar one. And then I just picked up a bunch of these sprigs of boxwood because they're a super good deal. You get two sprigs for a dollar. So I just grabbed five of them so that I can add them in here and there to probably more my fall decor. I doubt there'll be any in my Halloween decor because they had black boxwood. How cute, I'm gonna use in my Halloween decor. This one, I mean, it's a bigger one, so I can um, use it as one piece or I can cut pieces off, which I will probably do. This one was $3, but it is a lot bigger. So they have black boxwood for Halloween. Okay, grab that. And then I just got some like burlap ribbon just in case I needed some extra. This was a dollar. Um, and let's see, oh. I also got this cute little sticker pack that I, I'm i trying to figure out how, but I am gonna do a DIY. So they spell out Hocus Pocus and it has like two black ravens. This was $3, you can see there. So I'm definitely gonna do a DIY with this. I'm still trying to figure out exactly how I'm gonna do it, but I didn't sleep much last night, so I was thinking a lot about it and I have some ideas. If you have some ideas, post them below. Um, oh, I also got this cute little sign that I think is gonna go really well on the tiered tray that I'm gonna use for Halloween. It says, All Hallows Eve. I might distress this a little bit too because it is very like brand new feeling and I like more of a rustic feel. Um, but it was just a dollar, just a dollar. And then I got two because I told you I like black cats. Two of these um, black cat wood ornaments. I got the thin ones, so they were just a dollar a piece. They do have this like gold glitter going around the edges and Kim is trying to get my attention, so you may see her in a minute. Um, she doesn't like that I'm doing this video because I've been videoing for a little while now. I am like in love with these. 
They are so super cute. I know I'm gonna use one on a tear tray. I'm not sure I'm gonna use the other one for. Let me know if I should keep the glitter on these or if I should um, uh, take it off with some like sandpaper. I'm not sure. I'm probably just gonna leave it on. It's gold. It does go all the way around on both of them. I don't know. Let me know. Post in the comments. What would you do? Then, okay, last but not least, this is actually not Halloween or fall, but I'm redoing my wall in the kitchen. Um, I really only have one wall to play with because of all the cabinets, and it's a small wall, but I got these cute letters. They are, again, um, just particle board, but they're a decent size, as you can see, and they spell out eat. So there's an E in here, an A, and a T. I got all three of them for just $5. I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave them this color or if I'm gonna try to paint them or stain them. Haven't decided yet. We'll see once I do my wall. Actually, I think I'll probably figure out what I'm gonna do with them and then I'll show you how I'm gonna set my wall up and then actually get it up on video for you guys. So let me know in the comments if you wanna see, um, kitchen decorating, like decorating a kitchen wall because that's gonna be one of my projects. Um, let me know in the comments if you wanna see that. I have some other pieces from Walmart that I really am so super excited about that I am gonna put up on my kitchen wall, but I'm not gonna spill the beans on those. They are so super cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, anyway, the eat sign love it would you leave it as is would you stain it would you paint it it's particle board i'm not sure if you can stain particle board i've got to look that one up i gotta ask google i don't know hey google can you stain particle board on the website homeguides.sfgate.com they say you can change that with a stain particle board is very porous so it's important to seal it first to allow the stain to soak in evenly so you got to seal it and then stain it particle board. Just learn that on Google. Okay. All right, guys. So that's my haul from Target for fall slash Halloween. I'm super excited to get to decorating. If you like anything in this video, give it a big thumbs up, please. I would really appreciate it. I mean, if you don't like it, give it a thumbs down because then I know you don't like this kind of stuff. Um, but when you give it a thumbs up, you not only help my channel, but you let Google yeah, Google, because Google owns YouTube. You let YouTube know what kind of videos you like so they can give you better suggestions on what videos to watch. Um, if you like this kind of video, if you like farmhouse, if you like DIYs, if you like decorating, if you like homemade and DIY stuff for your furry critters, your companions, your, your pets, your dogs, your cats, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because that's what this channel is all about. And then once you hit that subscribe button, smash that bell because then you'll get notified every time I post a new video so you never have to miss one. Wouldn't that be horrible if like the one video you missed was the one you wanted to see the most? You don't wanna do that. Hit the bell button. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.